Welcome to ID on Sports. My name is ID Uyo. The FIFA World Cup is arguably the biggest event in all of sports. And Muhammad Ali at one point was arguably the biggest name in all of sports. So how did the World Cup impact the career of Muhammad Ali? Well, for the answer, we have to go back to the 1974 World Cup held in what was then West Germany. That year, there were 16 teams in the tournament, and Africa's lone representative was Zaire. And that is our focus. After losing their opening round match to Scotland 2-0, they got humiliated by Yugoslavia 9 to nothing, making it the worst defeat in World Cup history up until that point. The president of Zaire, Mobutu Sesseko, sent a message to the team in West Germany telling them that they had embarrassed the entire nation of Zaire by losing so badly. He then threatens the entire team, letting them know in no uncertain terms that if they lost their final group match against Brazil, who, by the way, were the defending World Cup champions, by more than three goals, the players should not bother coming back home. Now, Zaire ended up losing to Brazil exactly three goals to nothing, and of course the players were in fact allowed to return home, but the damage had already been done. President Mobutu was so incensed at his team's performance at the World Cup that he cut funding for the entire football program and he looked for other ways to redeem the country's sporting image, which he felt had been badly damaged. And that's where Muhammad Ali comes in. The government of Zaire, using the funding originally intended for the football program, offered to stage the heavyweight championship fight between George Foreman and Muhammad Ali in what would become known as the Rumble in the Jungle. So the choice of Zaire as a venue for the Ali Foreman fight was as a direct result of the unfortunate performance of the football team at the 1974 World Cup. Now, Muhammad Ali would go on to beat George Foreman to regain the heavyweight championship of the world, and Zaire, now known as the Democratic Republic of Congo, has not been to another FIFA World Cup since that appearance in 1974. So that's how the World Cup impacted the career of Muhammad Ali. So be sure to follow us on Facebook and like us on our YouTube channel. That's all for now. My name is ID Uyo. Thank you so much for watching this edition of ID on Sports.